Can you even imagine a digital currency that started off as a hilarious prank? Well, that's exactly what Dogecoin is all about. Back in the day, some tech-savvy folks decided to create a crypto inspired by a popular internet meme featuring a cute little Shiba Inu dog. Yeah, you heard me right. A dog meme turned into a legit cryptocurrency. What a time to be alive! But hold on to your hats, because this story takes a wild turn. Dogecoin didn't just sit there collecting virtual dust. Oh no, it went on a crazy adventure! Its value went from a measly 0.2 pennies in 2018 to 60 pennies at its peak in mid-2021. I know, I know, it sounds like peanuts, but if you crunch the numbers, that's actually a mind-boggling 29,900% increase. Can you imagine turning 100 bucks into nearly 30 grand? It's enough to make your head spin. With its astronomical rise, Dogecoin minted some brand new millionaires, making some people swim in cash. But wait, there's more. Dogecoin has so many layers to its tail. From its comical beginnings to the scandals that have rocked its journey, this doggy has seen it all. So stick around, grab some popcorn, and make sure to stay till the end of this video. Back in 2013, a software engineer named Billy Marcus and Jackson Palmer, a marketing specialist, thought it would be hilarious to create a digital currency that poked fun at all the serious cryptocurrencies out there. And thus, Dogecoin was born. But here's where things get really interesting. Dogecoin started gaining attention and soon became the talk of the town, especially within Reddit and online communities. It was like everyone suddenly wanted a piece of the doggy action. At first, Dogecoin didn't really have any actual value. It was just a virtual coin floating around. But then, people started using it to tip and make donations, and that's when its value started to climb. Now, let's fast forward to a moment that truly captured the spirit of Dogecoin. The Jamaican bobsled team, after a whole decade, qualified for the Winter Olympics. The only hitch was that they didn't have enough money to actually go to the Olympics. Enter our hero, Jackson Palmer, and the Dogecoin crew. These guys were huge fans of the movie Cool Runnings, which was all about the Jamaican bobsled team's Olympic journey. They couldn't let their favorite team miss out on this opportunity, so they sprang into action. They created a Dogecoin address and shared it on the Dogecoin subreddit, calling for donations to support the Jamaican bobsled team. And guess what? In just a matter of hours, the donations started pouring in. Eventually, they managed to raise 25 million Dogecoins, which is equivalent to a whopping $25,000. Initially, the founder and the early community members had a light-hearted approach, embracing the fun and generosity that Dogecoin represented. It was all about having a good time and not taking things too seriously. But as word spread beyond the Reddit group, something unexpected happened. People started looking at Dogecoin as more than just a joke or a meme. They began to see it as a legitimate investment opportunity, the perception shifted, and Dogecoin started gaining traction in the wider world, and things started to become really serious. But hold on. Before you start getting all serious watching this video too, let's take a quick moment to hit that like button. And while you're at it, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. That way, you won't miss out on the serious content that's coming your way. In early 2021, Dogecoin experienced a remarkable surge in popularity that resulted in a significant increase in its price. This surge was largely influenced by the attention it received from influential figures and the hype it generated on social media. One of the most notable events that contributed to Dogecoin's rise was when Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla and SpaceX, started tweeting about it. Musk has a large following on social media, and his tweets have been known to impact the prices of cryptocurrencies, especially Dogecoin. Whenever Musk mentioned Dogecoin or posted memes related to it, it created a buzz and attracted a lot of attention. A few companies have also decided to embrace the Doge spirit and accept Dogecoin as a form of payment. The Dallas Mavericks, for example, made headlines by announcing that they would accept Dogecoin for tickets and fan merchandise online. Additionally, Post Oak Motor Cars, a luxury car dealership based in Texas, also hopped on the Doge train and started accepting Dogecoin as a payment option. As Dogecoin gained mainstream acceptance and its value soared to new heights, many early holders experienced immense wealth from their investments. One of these individuals is Glauber Conte Soto, an employee at a music company. He claimed to have invested his entire savings, an estimated $180,000, into Dogecoin when its price was relatively low. Benefiting from the subsequent price rally, his investment saw substantial growth, 
resulting in an overnight transformation into a million dollar worth of money. However, as the saying goes, easy come, easy go. The sudden rise of Dogecoin was followed by a subsequent decline from which it has not yet recovered. Many people lost a significant amount of money when they got caught up in the hype and bought at the peak of the price, leaving them with substantial losses. The volatility of Dogecoin's price can be attributed to several factors, such as market speculation and hype. However, it is also inherent in the nature of the Dogecoin system itself. Dogecoin lacks a clear utility or purpose. Unlike some other cryptocurrencies that have specific applications or use cases, Dogecoin remains largely driven by its community and the hype surrounding it. It's both a strength and a weakness, depending on how you look at it. Another factor is its inflationary nature. You see, unlike Bitcoin, which has a capped supply, Dogecoin doesn't have a maximum limit. This can result in the price decreasing over time unless there is a significant change in trend or hype surrounding it. However, Dogecoin does have a capped inflationary supply of 5 billion USD per year. So, where does Dogecoin stand today? Interestingly, some even predict a positive future for Dogecoin. The Nasdaq, a renowned stock exchange, has made a prediction that Dogecoin could be here to stay and grow. Over time, the inflation rate of Dogecoin will decrease. This is because the fixed reward for creating new Dogecoins will be divided among a larger number of existing Dogecoins. According to Nasdaq, by the year 2040, Dogecoin's inflation rate will have dropped to about 2.4%. This is similar to the inflation rate of US dollars today, and by 2060, the inflation rate will be even lower at around 1.6%. By that time, Dogecoin could potentially be seen as a strong and predictable investment. Dogecoin's price is quite tricky to predict, and making money from it can be a real challenge. It's like trying to solve a Rubik's Cube blindfolded, and it's definitely not for the faint of heart. So what are your thoughts on Dogecoin and the future of meme coins? Do you think it's just a passing fad, like those funky dance moves we see come and go? Or do you believe it has the potential to become a significant player in the cryptocurrency world? Feel free to share your thoughts, insights, and predictions down below. We're all ears. And hey, while you're here, why not check other videos on the channel? It's packed with fascinating content that'll keep you entertained and informed. Thanks for tuning in and I'll catch you in the next video.